In a quaint, weathered cottage, nestled on the edge of a serene forest, lived Lily, a woman whose heart was etched with the scars of a love lost long ago. Her days were spent in solitude, surrounded by memories of the man she had once adored, Daniel. Their love story had been one of pure magic. Lily and Daniel had grown up as childhood friends, their bond deepening with every passing year. Their love blossomed like the wildflowers that adorned the meadows surrounding their small town. They were inseparable, sharing dreams and secrets under the canopy of stars that stretched above their sleepy village. But as fate often does, it played a cruel trick. One stormy night, while Daniel was away, lightning struck a massive oak tree that had stood sentinel over their favorite clearing for centuries. The tree fell, crashing onto their secret spot where they had carved their initials into the bark. That night, as the tempest raged outside, a letter arrived bearing the gravest of news. Daniel had been lost at sea, his ship engulfed by a monstrous storm. Lily's world shattered, and the vibrant colours of her life turned to grayscale. She retreated into the cottage they had planned to share, a sanctuary of memories that held her close, but also held her captive. The town watched as Lily's spirit withered, like a flower robbed of sunlight. Years passed, but Lily remained trapped in her memories, haunted by whispers of Daniel's laughter and the warmth of his embrace. The villagers tried to pull her back into the world of the living, but she had built an impenetrable fortress around her heart. Then, one crisp autumn day, a stranger arrived in the village. His name was Noah, a gentle soul with a heart full of kindness and a pocket full of stories. He'd heard of the woman who'd loved and lost and chose to live in the shadow of her own memories. Noah was drawn to Lily's cottage as if an invisible thread tugged at his soul. He introduced himself to Lily with a friendly smile, and despite her initial reluctance, she found herself drawn to his warmth and the tales he wove. Day by day, Noah chipped away at the walls guarding Lily's heart. They would sit by the fireplace, reminiscing about her time with Daniel, and as the stories flowed, so did her tears. Noah's presence breathed life into Lily's cottage, turning it from a mausoleum of memories into a haven of hope. He planted a garden of wildflowers in the meadow where the old oak tree once stood. They flourished, a vibrant tribute to love's enduring legacy. But even as a tender friendship grew between Lily and Noah, she wrestled with guilt, fearing she was betraying the love she had lost. Noah, however, saw things differently. He believed that love had the power to multiply, not divide, and that Lily's heart had enough room for both Daniel's memory and a new love. As the years rolled by, Lily and Noah's bond deepened. They shared their dreams, fears and laughter, just as she had with Daniel. With each passing season, Lily's heart, once frozen in time, began to thaw. The pain of loss didn't disappear, but it found a home alongside the warmth of new love. One evening, under a sky ablaze with stars, Noah took Lily's hand and whispered, Love never truly dies, Lily. It endures, it evolves, and it weaves a tapestry of memories that stretch across eternity. Daniel's love is a part of you, just as mine is now. We are all connected by the thread of love. Tears glistened in Lily's eyes as she realized the truth of Noah's words. She had carried Daniel's love with her all along, and now she had found a new love in Noah. The cottage, once a place of mourning, had transformed into a sanctuary of love and acceptance. Noah and Lily's love story became legendary in the village, a testament to the enduring power of the heart. Whispers of eternity filled the air, as the past and present intertwined in a tapestry of love, reminding all who heard the tale that love could conquer even the deepest of sorrows, and that the heart, with time, could find its way back to life. This is Inspirational Stories. Thank you for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe. Have a nice day. Have a